Hey guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I'm gonna show to make this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So friends, first of all, let's go to here, enable title action save and go to ellipse tool. Let's select ellipse and hold shift. Let's create new ellipse tool here. Classification tool and let's Select shape layer, change name 1, hold control, double click this icon for move anchor point center. Click session 2, go to window, enable align, and click this icon and this icon for move the object to center. So, right now, let's go to fill, select none for close inside color, click OK, and go to stroke width, let's change stroke like this. Okay, so in this time, let's change color let's change color like this click ok and let's control d for duplicate press s change scale like this again control d press s change scale and again control d press s change scale and again control d press s change scale and let's change stroke width here and finally again control D, press S, change scale 10. Okay, that's good. So close this scale settings and select layer 1. Let's control D and move to behind here, press S, change scale. Again control D, move to behind, press S, change scale. And let's again control D. But change this scale and again change scale like this okay so let's go to fx presses short effect drop shadow select drop shadow for use layer 3 and let's change quality full okay let's zoom to here change stroke opacity like this and go to eye drop select this red color back to shadow of color change to dark red click ok and change distance Let's change direction and change softness like this. Okay, so select drop shadow of FA control C and select all layers without layer 3 and control V. Okay, that's good. So we can change some rotations, select layer 7 and change like this, select layer 6, change like this and layer 9 let's try change rotation direction like this okay let's try like this okay that's good so let's close title action save and right now go to window i will use animation comes there 3 select all these layers go to starter preset and i want to scale animation let's open here let's use overshot scale Let's see. Okay, I will use overshot scale from anchor point. Click in and close animation composer. Right now, select this layer 10. Let's move to right and layer 9 move to right and this move to right. I will make step by step animations. Okay, let's see. Nice, let's change quality quarter. Okay, let's move to right these marks for slow animation. Let's see. Okay, that's good. So right now, let's select this layer 2. Let's press P and hold Alt, click this icon for add expression. And right here, we go 1, 10. Click this empty title for done expression. Let's see. Okay, so let's edit this expression and copy. Select other layers and press P. Let's hold Alt, click time icon. Let's control V and here, control V and here and here and let's close 
expression like this let's see okay that's good so select layer 1 press P and hold alt click time icon control V and here let's select these layers press P make someone for these layers and finally layer 8 and let's close expression settings let's see okay that's good let's create new solid layer and use this red color click right name background click ok move to behind and let's go for a second press T make opacity 0 make opacity frame go to here and change 100 let's move to here move to right a little bit okay nice so friends thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck